got a couple of people that ask me about portable apps, portable software. What is this? What is that? What? How do you? What do you mean? So instead of explaining this a thousand times to a thousand different people, I figure this might be useful for everyone out there that's checking out my YouTube channel, or just so everyone can get an idea on what it's about. Because there's not really a good tutorial, or you know, how to use this. How good is it? Is it better than Cameo? Is it better than other? Is it better than WinRare, Seven Zip? When you make portable apps, yes, this is the best one. It does take longer, but you will not have any issues with the software once it's portable. So I'll just give you a little quick idea on what we do. It's gonna. This is just gonna do a post scan and just scan whatever in the beginning. This one. And then once that goes to step two, which is the disk, it's telling you to install the disk. So if you don't have the disk and you just have the software on your computer like me, you just go to your software, double click it, install it. And if it's pre-cracked or if it has a crack that you have to put, you know, re, re put, put in yourself or if it has a serial key generator or whatnot all you do you got to make sure that you have the um, serial code or crack or whatever or patch and that's so that the port portable app will last forever and it won't be a waste of your time building it one time forever so once that's installed as you can see I just did virtual DJ 7 Pro and I just checked all of these just just to just to make sure that everything does not get an error when I uninstall this from my computer. This portable app should work perfect because I checked all of these. It's only going to give you standards to to just get you know get this one, Virtual Pro. But just in case, do it all so you don't have any errors. You shouldn't have any errors. But just in case. I would do that and then let me make sure I'm talking here. Alright. Um for manage with Horizon Application Manager. No, you don't have to check that. Oops. Every everyone. Full right recommended for Windows. Do the first one. All all first first. And uh, right here is what you want to change. You want to check that. Make sure it's a virtual package, which is a, you know, a virtual app. So that's it. Leave everything the same. Save it. Now it will be building my project. Now, the beginning part did take at least 10 to 15 minutes. That's why I started it kind of in the middle. Um, so it's very easy to do this once you make one portable app it's you're gonna know how to do this I made like 15 and now it's like sometimes I'll still double read it just to make sure I'm not gonna mess up but just it's so easy to do this kind of stuff I'm just gonna um want to pause it real quick Alright guys, we are at the last part here for building the app. You leave everything alone and you just build it. Now this is going to take quite a long time, so I'm just going to say a few more things. Either pause the video or end it there. But I want to show you guys that this really works. So I want to uninstall my thing, my program that I install, and I want to show you the portable app that I just made to show you that it works correctly and you should have no issues in the future with building any portable software with this software um, so yeah, I'll pause it here for now alright guys we're back now it just finished and I'm just gonna let you guys know that this is a four or five minute video so far and 
it took at least 10 or 20 minutes to do all of these so this might seem long this video but it's going to take you a lot longer when you do it so don't expect it to go by as fast as this video so just giving you a heads up I usually just make a new folder and name it whatever software you're making portable so I'll just name it virtual DJ virtual 7 DJ pro portable and I usually just take it everything in there highlight it all and drop it in there once that's done now you got your portable app of virtual pro let's test it out play you guys one of the songs that I just made let me know how you like it if you like it I'll send you guys the link if you need any, any of my music guys we are back with the portable app let's make sure everything works we haven't got any er errors yet um let's test out a song see if it works my favorite one is the Denon or Pioneer Well, that was an error from the get-go, that one. That one doesn't work. So I knew that. Alright. Leave it there. So, let's test it out. Let's see if it works. Alright, it just crashed on me. Let's just try that again. That is not a good sign. Alright, so it works. something new and send me some messages if you need help and thanks for watching my video